Hi everyone, welcome to ThemeScot. In this video training, I'm going to walk you through how to create a MailSimp account properly. So let's go ahead and dive in. Now, the first thing I would like to do is open up my browser and I'm going to search for MailSimp.com. Hit enter. And here I'm on the official website of MailSimp. And on the top right corner here, you can see sign up button. To create an account, just click on sign up button. And MailSimp shows us the available packages. Depending on the number of contacts and how many times do you like to send emails to your customers, you should choose the package. But if you are going to start with MailSimp, I would like to recommend you to choose the free plan. Just click on sign up for free. And here goes the sign up page of MailSimp. First of all, I would like to enter the email address and select a username and password. So let's do it. First of all, I'm just going to type my email address. It will automatically select an username for me. I'm just going to choose this part only. And password. I need to set a password. So I'm going to set a password. Here it is. It's absolutely fine. And here goes our checkbox. If you don't want to receive any email from MailSimp, like newsletters, updates, anything, then check this box. And finally, click this sign up button. Okay, here we are. MailSimp wants us to verify our email account. Here you can see check your email. We have sent a message to this email address. So I'm going to go ahead and open a new tab. I'm going to access my Gmail account. And here you can see a new email, active your MailSimp account. I'm just going to open this email, just click on it. And here you can see a big button, activate account. So to activate our MailSimp account, just click activate account. Okay, our account is activated. Now we need to set up our account. Here you can see account setup. To set up our account, we need to enter our first name. My name's Imran and my second name and my business name. Okay. And phone number. It's recommended but not mandatory. Okay. So I'm just going to so hit next. Here it is. Here I'm just going to add my address okay i'm just going to click next okay what's your top goal with mailsimp i would like to just drive sales revenue and conversion so i'm just going to tick this fast radio box if you have different purposes just select from here or you can skip for now okay i'm just going to click next and great. What do you want to explore first? Do you want to explore email, automations, sign up form? Okay, just let me create the account. I will decide it later. So I'm just going to click skip. Here, how many email contacts do you have? Actually, as a beginner, I would like to select 0 to 500. But you can also skip this part i'm just going to click next how do you sell to your customers okay i have an online store or you can select any other option or you can select we are not currently selling i'm just going to click next want to import your brand website url okay i'm just going to type my website url and hit next Here we are and almost done, but it asks us to select the package once again. So what we can do, just click here, continue free. It's going to prepare our account. Here you can see the progress. That's all. We are here on the dashboard of MailSimp account. Here you can see my email and 
everything on the right campaign, automations, audience, analysis, website, a lots of things we will learn step by step. Okay. Well, friends, I believe you could successfully create the MailSimp account. I request you to like this video and share it with your friends. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I will create more videos on MailSimp and web designing development. So stay with me. Thank you. Thank you for watching.